Hi everyone. So we're going to do part two of the second jar from Fond du Lac. And yes, I got my hair cut today. Um, it's not 100% how um, I want the style, but it is what it is. It's a fresh cut. Also, I did um, a video with this jar and I never finished it. So we're going to actually finish this too because there's not too much of this, you know, either one of them left. So that's what we're going to do. How is everyone today? I'm doing well. Staying blessed and safe. Okay, so that's it for that jar. Um, all right, let's just run through this. Um, so this is all tangled, but it's all, um, let me put this down a little bit. It's all like Mardi Gras and, you know, some Valentine beads that probably lit up at one point. And then some little necklace on a string with, glitter and little hearts floating in there that says love but I don't know whether to oh and there's also this necklace too on the straw I'm just putting this all in crafting okay so we got a wooden bracelet stretchy that'll go with the wooden stuff um we have a wraparound bracelet I can get it untangled. All right. Very heavy. These are like metal beads or glass beads. I don't know which. All silver tone. But it has a lot of wear to it. So that'll go into um, crafting. Um, here's a pearl necklace. But yeah. All the... All the... Um, paint or whatever coating is coming off but these are very heavy duty beads so i don't know if they're they're kind of cold but i don't know if they're glass or what so but i'm still putting them in crafting another little beaded stretchy bracelet so that'll go in with the wooden stuff another little wooden bracelet same as before um oh look at the little teapot or flowering pot, I don't know which. Little pin. Um, unmarked, I believe. Yeah, it's unmarked, but it's in great condition. So that's a keeper. This is um some type of leather <clears throat> um bracelet. It's like almost like a buckle. Opens like so, take it out. There it is. Um, it says Nine West on it, but I mean, it's in great condition. I don't know if that's supposed to be, hold on, let me click this shut. I don't know if this is supposed to be the style or if that's just dingy or what. I don't know. I'm confused about that. So I'm going to put that in a lot. Of like wearable stuff. Um, here's a white bangle has the safety. Um, but this thing is in bad shape. I mean, real bad shape. And right offhand, I don't see any names, but this is gonna go on crafting. Oh, and I just broke it. So, yeah. Um. Another little homemade kids bracelet crafting. Oh, this is cute. Oh, this is a bracelet. All right, check this out. So it has the extender. Okay. And it has two, two uh, chains on each side. And then these hearts. And they have little crystals in them. One says, care, give, and 
Inspire. So that's a cute little bracelet. Um, oh, this is broken. It's missing a clasp. Nice little box chain. And from here I can tell it's silver. Has the 925 tag on it, but it's missing a clasp. But that's okay. Uh, here's another little Mardi Gras type necklace. Um, oh, these are nice. Some gold tone square uh, screw back and clip earrings. Great shape. There's the back. And I do see a marking. And Napier. Napier, Napier. A lot of people say it differently. So that's cool. That's a nice pair of earrings. Oh, here's a little cross. I wonder if that was on that necklace. Looks like little margasites. Mar Let me see. Yeah, them are actual margasites. That's cute. It's not sticking. I'm not going to test today. I'll test off camera. Oh, this is gorgeous. Oh, it's missing one, one stone right there. Too bad. That is gorgeous. Here's the back. I don't see a name or anything, but wow. That's gorgeous. Hmm. I'm gonna set that aside. Little cross ring, but it's it's in bad shape. See all the copper in the back. So that'll go on crafting. Um, here's a gold tone necklace. It's kind of worn on the back. It has a little extender. Oh, I have it backwards. Huh, that's cute. Too bad the back is kind of in bad shape. Like it's wearing, like the copper is coming through. A little stone in the middle too. Oh, this is an Avon piece. NR and then Avon. So that'll go into crafting. Um, someone's homemade um, necklace. What would Jesus do? All glass beads. So that'll go in crafting. Or a lot. I don't know. Oh, here's one of them. Um, these are like metal. Has the little flower on it. I forget what that maker's mark is. Yeah, it's like a little daisy or something. Here's a purple one. I have a lot of these, all different colors too. Oh, this is pretty. This is AE. Is that Aeropostale? Almost looks like silver. And then it has, this is like a, like a silk thread fabric, braided. And then this right here, these are little amethyst bees, beads. And it has that little chunk of amethyst stone in there. And it has wire wrapped all around it. And then it has little, like, Oh, them are little chunks of um, um, amethyst beads, too, wrapped all around that. That's cute. All right. Um, this was probably a rosary. Some of these beads have carvings in them. I know that these beads are some type of like bean or something like that, but that'll go in with the wood stuff. 
Um, aw, little girl named Kelly made this, so that'll go on crafting. Stick pin with a C L A. Oh, these are moving too. Huh. Let's see here. Oh, it's sticking, so no precious metal. Um, a little plastic glitter bracelet crafting. I remember wearing them when I was in middle school. Here's another brooch. Look at them uh, AB crystals. How pretty. Here's the other side. Offhand, I don't see any... I don't see a maker's name, unless I'm missing it. That happens a lot of times. Um, um, this necklace, part one, remember I showed you this necklace? Come to find out, it does have a maker's name on it. Where is it? But it's real faded. It's coral. I know I've seen it somewhere. But anyway, it's coral. So yeah, check that out. That's pretty. That's real pretty. I'll put that there. Here's uh this is what I left off on the last video. Little mesh gold tone bracelet. Box class. And let's see here. This is, I thought it was marked. Yeah, it is. Let's see, who is this? Oh, Avon. So it's an Avon piece. It's in good shape. Little tone, um, little bracelet has a little bar going on, you know, through the mesh. That's cute. Little homemade braided sea bead. Crafting, another wood stretchy that'll go with the wood stuff. Um, this is some type of stone because it's cold. And I don't know if that's carnelian or, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that could be, but it's definitely some type of stone because it's cold. Little um, tie tack. Oh, another pair of clip-on earrings, silver tone. Just needs to be shined up. And this does say something. What does that say? JJG. Never heard of it. I don't know what this came off. Oh, it's a pin. Look at that little inky dinky pin back there. And what is this? An eagle? And that's mother of pearl. And then some other dangles with that fabric. Okay. Um, aw, look at this earring. I wonder if I had the other one. I don't know. And then this earring, but this is in bad shape, so I might, yeah, I think I'm just going to throw that away. And then this was stuck to my magnet. And yeah, that's it. That's it for that jar. Oh, this too. It's like a bracelet watch. Let me see, what does this say? Oh, and Klein too. And Klein. This needs to be shined up. That's actually a really nice uh, bracelet watch. No, oh, that's silver. I don't know. I'll check it off camera. All right, now for this. Um, I totally forgot about this jar. Ain't much in here. Holy moly. Look at this is a pin. Or a brooch. What 
with a big old fake diamond. The patina it has on it. Are they missing? Yeah. I don't know. The patina on this almost looks like it's silver, so I'm going to check that. And this, I believe that's plastic. Some odds and ends. What's in this bag here? Ooh, this is pretty. These are real pearls. But I don't know what kind of stone. Ooh, them are gorgeous. Very, very pretty. So them, that's a, like, like a light blue. And then these are real pearls too. And then with, with uh, like a darker shade blue or turquoise. These are, this one is a little bit bigger though. That's cool. Oh yeah, that's nice. That's very nice. All right. Um, this is still sealed shut. Looks like a, a faux pearl necklace. Um couple pins in here they're identical they say ABC Los Angeles 1984 and oh this one says Sarajiva 1984 I don't know they're little pins okay um here's a pair of earrings Oh, sorry. Pierced earrings. Them are enamel. Nice. Oh, check this out. Copyright and then a capital E-I or E-L. I'm not sure. Look at that. How adorable. It's a little boot. It's a brooch. Hey, if anyone knows what that marking is, could you let me know? That is too cute. Great condition, too. All right, what else do we have? All right, here is a necklace on a string. Got a little woof on there. I don't know if that's supposed to be for some type of sports or something, but it's going in crafting. Um, what is this? Oh, okay. Here's the clasp. has the extender. And it's a three-tier gold tone necklace. Great shape. Just needs to be cleaned up a little bit. And I don't see a, a maker's name or anything on it. So that's nice. It's a nice, lot of little inky dinky beads and stuff. So I'm just going to get these all out of the way. All these little beads. That's like a broken bit. Here's a little shell. I have a whole container here that I'm starting with all these little bits and pieces and everything. So, all these are going near. Here's some more. Oh, them are nice beads. Nice and heavy, too. So, yeah, that's cool. Okay, um, the heck is that? It's supposed to be an earring? Mm -hmm. Here's a clip-on earring. Oop. Here's it. Oh, that's pretty. 
There's a pierced earring. Here's a, a screw back and clip on with hearts. There's a name on it too. That's actually cute. I feel like I have another one of these. Napier. Gold and black. Here's a big old hoop. This one's pretty worn and everything. So that'll go in crafting um, because someone can use these. <clears throat> now they're broken a little bit, probably broken uh, earring. What does this say? Chico's. Almost matches that necklace I found the other day. But I don't see um, a match. Here's another couple little beads. Shell. That's a cute earring. Pierced. Yeah, none of these have matches. Oh, this is adorable. Look at this one. I have, but some, I think I've seen this before. I think I have the match to this. Has a name. Napier. It's like brand new. That's adorable. Um, oh, a pair. Her gold studs. Gold tone. Let me see. Yeah, gold tone. Um, another hoop. Which isn't magnetic. Kind of has that look. Okay, I'll check that off camera. Here's a little ring, but it's, boy, is that in bad shape. So that'll go in crafting. Oh, here's a pair of earrings. These look silver too. I've seen bracelets like this, but not earrings. This one's acting funny here. There we go. Huh. Okay. Looks like a homemade little brooch. I think someone made it. Broken little bit. Oh, look at this earring. It looks like candy. Huh. Check that out. Reminds me of that old little candy that my grandma used to put out. Or one of my great aunts or something. Cute. Um, This, I have no idea what that's supposed to be. Could tell you. Another little hoop, gold tone. Broken bit. That kind of looks like silver though. Like the old, maybe not. <laughs> Psych. Oh look, we got a match. Awesome. Cause them are cute. Cool. Um, check this earring out. I wish I had a match to this. Couple little butterflies. Oh, and it has a little rhinestone there. Yeah, that's cute. Um, a little broken necklace. A little earring. And just odds and ends, guys. You know, that's it. Um, this is definitely my favorite piece. It's just missing a stone right there. So I'll definitely take time to find a stone for that. These earrings were nice. Oh, this boot. Oh, and let's not forget these two. Per real pearls. These are real pearls. And I don't know what kind of stones these are. I don't know if they're like dyed howl light or I'm I don't know I couldn't tell you but these are definitely real pearls beautiful beautiful 
beautiful. And yeah, um, and then these earrings aren't too bad either. And then this bracelet, I gotta find out what stone that is. Yeah, I gotta find out what that is. But that's it, guys. This is a short video. Thanks for watching. Um, I just I wanted to hurry up and finish this other half of this jar, and then I found this one, so I wanted to finish that. Um, so yeah, my next video will be the third jar. Remember, these, these are the four that I got, that my sister got me from her hometown of Fond du Lac. So, all right, everyone. Thanks for always watching and supporting. If you're not a subscriber, go down below, hit subscribe, hit the bell. Every time I put out a video, you will get notified. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Love you all. Peace.